Hi, this is Whitey from Scotland. You are watching Trucker Josh Vlogs on YouTube, along with the real star of the show, The Diesel. Mind to subscribe. Well, good morning, everybody. We're at the Co-op Card Lock in Weyburn, Saskatchewan. We're about to roll over to the other side of town, grab our freight, which I think are gonna be big giant spools. I explained it to you yesterday, right? These, these people in Toronto area that want them, that want them perfectly clean. So they asked that I would wash my freight before delivering it. And I sort of I gave a funny look I said, well, why, I've never washed my freight before. Why don't I just tarp it? Fantastic idea, right? So we're gonna tarp the freight. We wouldn't usually tarp these kind of spools, but uh, hey, they want clean freight. I'll bring them clean freight. I'm just not gonna wash it. <laughs> I gotta pay to wash that then. I don't have to pay to tarp it. Thinking, saving the money. Oh, this guy's waiting for me. Sorry. That guy didn't even know. Why was he waiting for me? He didn't have a stop sign, did he? I have no idea. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Stop means spin tire on pavement. That's what my dad told me anyway, when I was a kid. I tried. Well, Diesel, we've been here all day. All day. I'm tired. I'm dirty. I'm tired. I want to go home. So, this is the load. All tied down, chained down, and tarped. All kinds of spools underneath there. All the way to the back. It took all day. All day. Oh, and then just for the cherry on top of the cake, my batteries were dead when I came to start it and get going. I don't know why, so I don't know what that was all about, but we got her started. One of the guys in the shipping department where I picked up was super nice and he came out with his pickup truck and booster cables and boosted me up. Now I've ran over to the co-op to grab my coffee because I haven't had a coffee today. Can you believe it? The sun's about to go down and I haven't had a coffee yet. Uh, so we're uh, going to head back home for a couple of days. I'm going to get home tonight. It's going to be late tonight now. I wanted to be home earlier, but it is what it is. Which way do I go from here, Karen? You want me to turn left? Do you even know? You don't even know, do you? Are you jammed again? Karen! Come on. Come on, Karen. Yeah, she wants me to go left. I know where I'm going. We're gonna be going right back on that same route, Highway 2, all the way through Saskatchewan, the rest of Saskatchewan, and all the way through Manitoba to the southeast of Manitoba. I think it's straight through on this road. This road for 255 kilometers. There you are, Karen. Glad you joined the party. Better late than never. Yeah, we just gotta go straight down this road. Look right in front of us. It's right down here. All the way home. So it's about a half day drive to get home from here. And then when we leave for Toronto, it's about a two day drive to Toronto. But we're gonna make it into two and a half days because I'm gonna leave on Friday so we can get there Sunday night and deliver Monday morning. It sounds like I've got a got a reload already. Uh, probably some steel that's coming back to the Alberta oil fields. That's what I'm thinking is probably going to happen. So may as well hit the road. Looks like we'll be driving into the night tonight. Britt's not going to be happy. I told her I'd be home around supper. <laughs> 
Uh, she knows what trucking's all about. When I say supper, that means midnight. here but we're screaming past Winnipeg on the south side here about to turn on to uh, Lage Modier I believe Karen has a whole bunch of other names for the same road she's gonna pipe up right away but I can still remember when this part back here this would be better to show you this during the day but this is all subdivisions here now, right? All people living here. I still remember this being open field. Oh, and we're getting the light. Right on. RTE, heading north RTE, heading highway 59 south RTE, 59 leading latch about here and then keep to the right in 420 meters. Huh? Meters. Take the entrance to the right on RTE 20 North RTE 20 Highway 59 South RTE 59 Beating Lajibot here and then keep to the right in 420 meters. What? You're crazy, Karen. You need to go home. Houston? We have a problem. A whole line of the tree, a whole section, burnt out on us. And I wanna fix it, but I'm scared. Cause if I break any of these ornaments, I am a dead man. Don't do it, dad. Don't do it, mom will be so mad. Don't do it. No touching the tree, be very careful. Back away, back away like this. You gonna, you gonna take me over here? That's a good boy. Back away from the tree, Dad. Back. What are you doing? What are you doing? He always likes to like walk between people's legs. It's weird, man. It's weird. Stay away from the tree. Stay away from the tree. Mom will be so mad if you break it. Okay, I won't touch it. So for this Christmas, we're gonna have a dark section. You can see it better at night, but. Uh, that's too bad. I know. It's upsetting. It's upsetting, Chevy. Hey, Big Frank. Say hello to everybody. What? Hey, y'all. Diesel. You're next. I saw your tail wagon. You're next. Say hi. Hey, guys. So much Christmas. Where's, where's Wiener? Where's the Wiener? Anyone seen the Wiener? Chevy, where's the Wiener? Wiener! Wiener! Wiener? Wiener? I think I know where he is. 
Is there a wiener in here? There's no wiener in his belly. Wiener? Wiener? Wiener, what are you doing? What are you doing all by yourself? Hello. Guten Morgen, hello. You weren't bad, don't worry, you weren't bad. You're just chilling out here by yourself because you're a loner, that's fine. It's cool being a loner. It's all right. Go on, go join the family. You know you're gonna go sleep in your bed? You gonna sleep in there? Okay. He gets all sad and depressed when mom's not here. Mama's boy. Whatever. So yeah, we, uh, we made it home. Thank you for those of you who've been sending in your intros that I have at the beginning of these videos. I wanna get a whole bunch of new ones, uh, but uh, I always like including you guys at the beginning of the video, sort of makes you a part of what we're doing here, then it's not just me doing all the talking. You can get your voice in there too. You can uh, say whatever you wanna say, as long as it's respectable. Remember that children watch these videos. <laughs> so if, if you wouldn't say it in front of your children, then I probably wouldn't put it on my video. But you can try, you can send it in anyways, we'll see. See what happens. But it's, uh, yeah. It's a cold day outside, it's a little bit colder than it was last time, which is uh, unfortunate because we have some work to do. We still haven't finished the Christmas lights. We've gotten all the way around the house now, like we got those icicles there, right? And we got those green and red ones all the way around. I gotta put on another two strands at the back yet. And then we gotta go and do the garage. I should have started earlier. I'm totally gonna start earlier next year. We're gonna take them all down in spring, right? But next year, I think I'm gonna put them up in September. Just, this is too cold. Doing the, my fingers get cold. Coffee. Coffee. Coffee, where's my cup? There it is, it's over there. Hey. Hey. Those of you who don't know who this guy is, you've been asking. He's our foster boy. He's, uh, his name is Frank, also, Frankie. We call him Big Frank, and we call our wiener dog Frankie just wiener. This guy's, uh, this guy's mom is in the hospital. Well, not in the hospital, but she's going through some pretty, uh, serious treatments and stuff with the doctor and, uh, isn't able to care for him right now. So he's our foster. We're just taking care of him for a little while while well, she goes through that. One less thing on her plate, right? She's got enough to worry about having, a, uh, having to deal with the doctor all the time. So, and we don't mind. We're a dog-friendly household. Actually, I think we're a people-friendly household. They tolerate us. They run the place. Yeah. Appropriate, I think. Just a splash. A splash of milk. Put this back in the fridge before I forget and get in trouble when Britt gets back from work. Dun, 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 dun. What? I'm coming. Calm down. Oh. oh, yeah. There it is. The liquid life. Now we can get going with the day. Mmm. Oh, hot. Just the way we like it. Okay, so uh, I guess I'm gonna be working on getting these lights finished. These aren't all lights. Here, one sec. Trevor, are you gonna help me this time? No, you're just gonna sit inside. These are all just clips. We have tons and tons of these clips because I use way too many. I'd rather use way too many, that way uh, they definitely stay. It's the same way I, I tie down a load. I'd rather you use way too much load securement than not enough, right? You can never have too many straps on a load, but you can have too few. So you can never have too many clips on your Christmas lights, but you can have too few and then they hang and they fall down and it's just a pain in the butt. And, and I'm on the road and I don't expect Britt to climb up there and fix it if they fall down. So I better make sure they don't fall down. We've got to hang up all those up there. Well, that'll be my, uh, my adventure for tomorrow's vlog, I guess. We've got to end this here. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for hanging out with me. This was a really fun trip down to Georgia. I had a really good time. It was good to be down there again. And unfortunately, I am back up here where the cold hurts my face. That is our backyard. No comment other than that. And I've got to get back here with my ladder and finish this today. 
So what I do is I, 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 sh I should do this on tomorrow's vlog. I should tell you tomorrow. Yeah, we gotta save something for tomorrow, everybody. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna be included in the intro at the beginning of my vlogs. Even if you sent in one before, you wanna send in, send in another one. I don't care how many you send, I'll use them all. Uh, send it to tjv at email.com. That's email, not Gmail, email. Uh, link is down below in the description. You can click on that, you can send it there. If the file that you used is too big to send through email, uh, you can upload it to Dropbox, and then you can email me the link. And then I can go into my Dropbox and download it from there. I think that's how that works, right? Is that how that works? I don't know. It's, it's best if we can just email. Most people have been fine just emailing it. It's just like a short 15 second clip saying, hey, you're watching Trucker Josh Vlogs with Diesel or whatever you wanna say. Enjoy the show. You can add whatever you want in there. You can say your, your little bit in there, and uh, I think it'd be fun. And you can wait to see your face pop up on YouTube. Right? It's fun for everybody. I think so. See you guys tomorrow.